In this lesson, we learn how to find five number summaries. When finding a five number summary, we need to find the minimum, quartile one, quartile two, quartile three, and the maximum. The minimum is just the smallest number. The maximum is the largest number. The second quartile, or Q2, is simply the median. Q1 is found by finding the median of the first half of the data. Q3 is found by finding the median of the second half of the data. Here is a set of data. We will find the five number summary. One is the minimum. Nine is the maximum. We will now find the median or Q2. The numbers are already in order, so we just cross off numbers at each end until the median is left in the middle. We always cross the same amount off on the left as on the right. One, two, three. We are left with six, which is the median. We call this Q2. The second quartile means halfway through the data. Now we find Q1. We look at the data on the left of the median, but we do not include the median. We find the median of these numbers by crossing off each end. We have 3. Q1 is 3. Now to find Q3, we look at the data to the right of the median. We find the median of this. We get 7. Q3 equals 7. We now have the five number summary. The minimum is 1, Q1 is 3, Q2 is 6, Q3 is 7 and the maximum is 9. Here is another set of data. Find the five number summary. It is important to always put the numbers in order if they are not already. We have 0, 1, 2, 5, 6, 6, 8 and 8. 0 is the minimum. 8 is the maximum. Now we find Q2, the median. We cross off at each end. Now we have two numbers remaining. We can't cross them both out. If there are two numbers remaining, we look directly between them for the median. Halfway between 5 and 6 is 5.5. Now to find Q1. We find the median of all numbers left of Q2. Crossing off, we are left with 1 and 2. So Q1 is directly in between them. Q1 equals 1.5. To find Q3, we find the median of the numbers to the right of Q2. The median is between 6 and 8. Q3 equals 7. We now have the five number summary. The minimum is 0. The maximum is 8. Q1 equals 1.5. Q2 equals 5.5. And Q3 equals 7. Visit mathsathome.com for further videos and practice.